Hello everyone. Welcome to Honara's Arts and Lifestyle channel. Today I will be showing you how to organize and uh, store the items that we have used for Navratri preparation or any other festival preparation. It may be uh, the kalash that we have used or the silver plate uh, tables that we have used or maybe the jewelry, the sarees, the dresses that we have used for the kalash and all that. For that one of the major component that I am going to use is plastic boxes like this. Okay. This comes with a lid. Uh, you can even opt for uh, something which is uh, attached like this and which has a lock. I think that will be better. But in case if you don't get it, that is still fine. Okay. And we will be needing lots of cotton. Uh, for that, I suggest that uh, you buy a very big roll of cotton like this. Okay. Uh, this is about uh, 240 rupees. And if you buy one such roll like this, uh, then you should be able to put some 3 to 4 layers of cotton. Uh, into a box like this uh, for at least two to three boxes Now let me show you how to make layers of cotton using these cotton roll. I have already opened one of the cotton rolls Okay, so let me just show you in this one So this is how your cotton roll is going to look like after you open it I've actually used little bit of cotton from here but the original roll of cotton will be at least this thick okay to take out the layers what you will have to do is okay just split it like this take a thin layer and pull it all along so this will start coming out like a piece of cloth as you can see okay then once you remove it like this take your plastic box keep it here and measure how much of size you need for this plastic box okay so if I hold the cotton like this I will have to cut the cotton here if I want to fit it inside this box and this is where I'll be cutting it And there you go, the piece of cotton is ready. And when I put it inside the box, this is how it's going to look. So what, what I suggest you to do is take a good height of this box and you can actually organize the jewelry by putting layers of jewelry and then again another layer of cotton and then again jewelry and cotton. So that way you should be able to accommodate some five to six layers of jewelry uh, in, in, in a box like this. And it becomes very simple because all you need to do is just maintain one box rather than maintaining multiple boxes. One of the reason why I prefer using cotton is because when you start placing jewelry one on top of the other or one beside the other, it tend to rub each other and the stones tend to come out and it get damaged. So that is why we need to protect the jewelry from all the four sides if we want to maintain it for a very long time. So let me show you how to organize the jewelry using a box and a cotton like this. 